Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're doing a wee bit of maintenance to my nephew's wee bike. Um, I don't actually know what kind of bike it is or what the model is, I'll just check. Calm kind of bike, is it? It's a Sinus GPX. It's a Sinus GPX 125. I think they're quite new on the market. Um, turn the camera around, let you have a look at it. So, here it is. Quite a tidy little bike, this one. Um, so, all my nephew's doing today is, he's taking the fairings off. He's got a new oil filter, just giving it a wee bit of a service. Um, yeah, so the he started already. The side fairing, this has all got to come off. Just wants to gain access to the bottom here, and then we'll drain out of oil and get the get the filter removed. It wasn't even the right kind of car. You would have thought the police could have noticed that. Hey, you bastard. Right, that's the last bolt out there. This is the fern ready to be removed. We'll just give it a wee grab so we can hit the tarmac. Right, so that's enough access now that we can get in there, as you can see. Right, guys, apologies for the awkward angle here. That there is the sump plug. Um, we've got a wee tub here, just underneath, going to catch the oil. So... The wee man's going to get in, remove the sump plug, drain the oil out. Hopefully it's not too bad a colour. Uh, but this is kind of a low mileage bike. It's only done 1,600 miles. And I believe this is its first oil change. Try and not drop that nut in the oil. Yeah, I know. It's really awkward with it, so... <laughs> Look how black that is, guys. It's abs absolutely filthy. I uh, can't believe it's so dirty after so little miles. So it just goes to show that um, even a little engine like this, keep your maintenance up to date guys. Cheeky little oil change. That's well worth doing. Any young boys that think you just have to race around on these things, this way they don't usually last that long because this sort of stuff's not done. A wee filter, a litre of oil, it's not very expensive. So I've just been informed that this oil change should be done around every 600 miles on these little engines or they just fall apart. So I think 600 miles is a bit keen. I'd probably do it at 800 to 1000 miles. Right so this is where obviously the, the old uh, oil filter is housed. It's quite manky. So we've got a new one to go in there. Right, as you can see guys, unfortunately, it looks like uh, my nephew has fucked up again and he's got the wrong oil filter. So, on this occasion, we're going to put the old filter back in. I'm going to slap his head and he's going to order the right filter to replace it. Which means another oil change, guys. Oh, that's not even fitting. So, a little bit of advice for everybody. Make sure you order the right parts if you're buying stuff from eBay. It's an inexpensive item, but when you've got to buy two of them, it starts to add up. <laughs> right, so once that you put the uh, the new oil in the bike and the dirty oil filter, uh, what we have to do is we'll have to start it up and bring it up the temperature. Um, once it's up the temperature, we'll just check the levels again. Callum, if you do the honours. Is that it started? Sounds like it's only running on one cylinder, mate. <laughs> I've had louder farts. Once you've warmed the engine up, guys, you'll find that uh, once the oil all circulates around everywhere, uh, that it'll dip, it'll dip again in the uh, dipstick. You just give it a wee top up. Um, and then you run it again just to be sure. 
and then it's a case of putting the fairings and stuff back on. Right guys, so this is the wee man now just buttoning, buttoning up the uh, fairings. Cracking wee bike this, um, if any of you are thinking of getting one. Uh, decent top speed. Callum, what, uh, what top speed have you had out of this one? About like 76 mile an hour. About like 76 mile an hour, on a private road obviously. Um, so yeah, decent for a little 125. Right guys, that's us uh, just uh, finishing up here. Thanks for watching the video. Um, see you on the next one. Bye for now. See you later, Carl.